Don't you ever go, don't you ever go, darling, cause you're all that I know, you're all that I know, why did you change your mind? Hello beauties, Beastly here, and today we have another box from Influencer and Remail. So as you guys can tell in my videos when I always open these boxes, there's always that paper that goes flying off. So we're going to try to avoid that today. Great. Okay. Oops. Alright, so you open it up and we have this right here. So there is like right here paper, so we take that off. And right here we have a mascara and then the paper it says it's the wonderful fully real mascara volumizing and lengthening lengthening <laughs> mascara with carotene for fuller longer lashes so it's this one right here guys and the next one so it comes in bubble wrap Eat <laughs> my eyes spice edition palette it's a mix of 12 shimmer and matte stay true shades for Stay true shades for all skin types. So you guys can see this. And so let's see, let's open this up. That's all that's in this box. And I do want to disclaim before I start that all these products, well, these two were sent to me complimentary for testing purposes so I can give my honest review. So another thing I really wanted to say is that for every single box box or anything I review, I put on this crown. So it's like the special review crown. And you guys have seen this crown before that I've used it for my um, Q&A. So I was thinking for this one, it's gonna be for special videos. So whenever we are already a year here on YouTube, I'll use this one. So we're gonna start with the eyeshadow palette. I feel like swatching all of these to see how they look up. All right, so this is how it looks close up. So we're gonna open it up. Wait, what? Oh my God. Okay, so you guys know how in the drugstore they'll give these like on both sides but this one actually has kind of like a bristle in a way oh, i think that's pretty neat okay so we're gonna swatch all of these okay so let's start all right guys so i got my camera so you can get more close-up ones and honestly all except two shades are really good so the second one is kind of like really light and this one right here um i actually tried going twice and it, compared to the other ones the other ones are really nice and pigment and shiny and shimmery this one wasn't great and this one right here but other than that these are actually pretty good so i can't wait to try it out okay so we're done with the swatches and that was really impressed except for those two colors that just said in the previous part i really don't know where to start as my base so let's see so i want to see if the fallout's kind of like crazy but i'm scared because i'm on my bed but let's see okay um the fallout was kind of crazy but let's see how it applies on the eyelid so at the beginning i did feel like it was kind of like patchy but you just keep on like trying to blend it in and it actually works pretty good whoa okay so the pigment is there for sure so, um okay <laughs> i think i'm gonna put like shimmers on the top of this one right here and i think i'm just gonna go in with the pinky and then for the bottom one i think i'm gonna try using this one so i'm gonna use like the one that has like the actual bristle and I think I'm gonna go with this shimmer, which is like a darker shade right here. They don't have names, so it's like this one. And I think I'm gonna put that like down here. Whoa, so it actually has like a lot of pigment, especially the shimmers. Like, whoa, I actually like this and this is not bad. I don't know if it says like the price anywhere. It doesn't, but oh my God. <laughs> So now we're just gonna do the right side, which is gonna be browns that I said. I was gonna use like brown colors. Um, so my camera is dying, so I have to do this pretty quick. Okay, and for the bottom part right here, we're gonna use this one right here, which is third to the last. So I'm so mad because I started to look at the footage just in case to see how it looked 
and I realized when I was trying out the mascara it looked really blurry and so I'm just gonna give you like <sighs> I'm just gonna give you a summary of what happened so basically when I first like tried it on so it felt really smooth that's for sure and then you open it up and it looks like this like a bristle just like that but now that I'm looking at it um it did, I feel like it didn't give it as much volume, but it did give it length for sure. And I, I kept on saying though, that if they make this into waterproof formula, or if I find it, that I will buy. I gave this a 9 out of 10, only because of like that purple shade, which was like, I didn't like the swatch, it was like burly there. But the other ones, the other ones made it up for that one. And the mascara, like now that I'm looking at it, um... Honestly, I would give it 8.5 out of 10 because I didn't feel like it gave it volume, but it for sure has gave it length. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I will see you in the future. Bye bye.